Hey guys, welcome back. That chicken just pooped. Welcome back to uh, Vanilla Play. I'm Modi101. We're back in our vanilla world. And I am picking up just where I left off. The only thing I did between episodes was to that five too many times. Was uh, kind of clear my inventory. So, all right. So let's. Uh, I don't remember what was wrong with this little mine shaft here. So let's go down and see if we can figure it out. If I can get this to connect to the other one, I think it'll work out well. Anyway, so how are you guys doing today? Hope everyone's doing well. That's my hope. Okay, see, yeah, see, it fell down here. Uh, well, I guess we're going to do some exploring now. Let's see what we got down here. Pretty big cave. Maybe we can find ourselves some gold. That's our our ultimate goal. I hear a whole lot of baddies. Oops, some iron. Cool. Hi guys. How you doing? Come here. Come here. You and you got a fancy outfit and you got a brain. Look at you. Ow. Get away from me. I get a weird feeling that we may have a zombie spawn around here somewhere. Hi, creeps. Bink. No. What? I just said no. Why do you not listen? Alright, let's see if we can find our way down here and figure out where all these zombie bags are coming from. We haven't really done much exploring in this series, so we'll take some time right now. Hi, hey, buddy. Just blew up your cousin. Get away. Get away. Stop it. Hey, that's my torch. Give me my torch back. What the hell are you doing? Steal a man's torch. There's rules. Alright, let's see. A little water area over here. Keep a keep an eye out behind us. This, this Hi Spides. Hi little spider guy. Go away. Go away, spider. You stay down there. I'm trying to light this place up over here. This is a huge cave. Be able to get lots of stuff from in here. There's a spider behind me. I still hear you. Let's uh Ooh, that's a drop to lava. Holy bad words. I guess there was... Oh, there's an emerald. That's cool. If we can ever get some villagers, we can trade with them. Alright, dead end. Good, good. Well, kinda. Wait, what is this? Huh. Weird. Alright. Well, we got a lava place down there, so... I hear you. Yeah, it's just dangerous as hell over there. Just stay away from over there, huh? Sounds like a plan. Well, plenty of gravel, which is good. If we need gravel, I guess. Oh, that is our uh, mine shaft. Okay. Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. How you doing? That is our mine shaft that we found when we were making our way down to our mines. We have this over here. I think that's still the mine shaft. Let's, uh... See if we can block this in a little bit. Stop it. Just want to get right up here. Come on. There's that. Come on. What, did they make the currents harder in 7.5? There we go. All right, well, we got the water under control, so that's good. Let's pick up this iron while we're here. Like I said, our main goal is to go find some gold. We need gold for <clears throat> the power rails, but we will need the iron for rails as well. All right, now that we can see down here a little bit, what do we got? What do we got? Can we get out of here safely? Oh, there's my torch. Hi, guys. You got some brains. That's fun. See, I just, I have a weird feeling that there's a zombie spawner around here somewhere. 
which would be awesome. But I don't generally get that lucky. Heard an Enderman. All right, let's kind of get back to what we were doing. I do need to pick up some cobbles. We'll do a little, little cobble farming here. I remember why I never actually jumped down here before, but this is why I stopped uh, making that staircase. So let's do this. Let's get a little bit of cobble. Let's kind of build back up so we can get out of here. Let's try to remember where the hole was. I think it was over here somewhere. All right, let's see. Oh, hi, skeleton. Yeah, I see you. Look at me. Look at me. You can't get me. It was a lucky shot. That's what that was. Oh, it's two of them. Oh, it's a, you got the twin brother here, huh? down here I see light I really need to get back to work but I just don't want to leave any any resources untapped especially like I said if I can find gold man this place is big I think this yet yeah, that leads back to our mine shaft there too so much my shaft beat must be pretty big and I can go down, and I did a little bit of it. I can go down to that mine shaft to uh, get us some more normal rails, which I was planning on doing. But I still need gold to be able to get to the um, the powered rails we're going to need, because we're going to need a lot of them. All right. So, wow, it was way up there. Let me see if I can uh, finish this staircase down to this level. Nope. Gonna have to go up. Alright, so. And then there, there. Let's see. Alright, there we go. Now, I do need to go down to our mine shaft to see where this would even connect because I have a feeling I'm gonna have to cut it. To the side pretty hard. All right, let's see if that works. Kind of get ourselves out of here a little bit. All right, cool. Yep, that worked. That gets us down. So what I want to do, <coughs> I guess I could run it through the mine shafts, but I like having a. Uh, Pretty standalone tunnel for yeah, my tunnel stuff. Is it nighttime? Uh, nope, it's not. Yes, no, almost. Let's go sleep real quick. And we'll go down in our actual mine shaft to try and get kind of the coordinates we need to make the two meet up. What I'll probably do is I'll build kind of retaining walls. Uh, where our little staircase is to kind of keep that separated <clears throat> so that you know because the last thing you want is for mobs to spawn in there and then you your cart hits them and stops and you got to go track it down so you want that any of your mine shafts with with rail carts in it to be pretty pretty empty so you can see how far we have to go down from there. That's why I think going at the angle, I get a feeling we might overshoot this. But let's let's see. So I'm thinking maybe somewhere around here. So let's see what our coordinates are. So, um, well, negative two twenty-five, negative three eight nine two. I'm actually going to grab a pen. All right, let me write that down because I kind of already forgot it. So X is negative 2, 2, 5, and Y is negative 3, 8, 9, 2. <coughs> Excuse me. So we can use that to kind of go get an idea of where we're aiming. 
Because I get a feeling I'm going to have to cut that tunnel we were making right there. Shut up. Probably to the right. Because it's starting to get pretty level with the uh, mine shaft. And the mine shaft is, or the abandoned mine shaft is only about halfway down from where we're trying to go. So. <clears throat> so this is the fun, exciting, normal stuff I would usually do off camera. But I figured, you know what? I did all the other one off camera. So we're going to do a little bit more on camera. Seems like a lot of this series, I'm playing 90% of it without you guys here, and that kind of defeats the purpose of it, so. All right. Oh, oh, see if we can get him up to our jail. I just, I don't have the brewing to change him over. It's a long way to go. I don't want to, I don't want to try and pull these guys from down here. I think it would be too much of a headache to try and get them down here, so. All right, so here we're looking at... What was it? 392. So let's see. Yeah, see, we got to go from here about. Mm, wow, a lot. 3892. So we got to go about 50 blocks that way. So let's actually start heading this way. See if we can start making our way down here. Let's go right along this wall. Seems pretty solid and pretty well lit, so I get a feeling something's gonna sneak up on us, but Alright. I totally know a zombie's gonna pop up here. Alright, so hopefully we don't run into any major caves along this route. I'm okay finding new caves, but it's going to be a lot of work if we're trying to... And see, we're still at level 29, so we have to get down to level 11. So let's see if we can get our way down here. We're making pretty good progress here. See, this is what I was worried about. Oh, gold. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Yeah, that's extremely important for the next phase of our little thing here. And I'm just hoping this mine shaft doesn't have to zigzag too much because that's going to eat up a lot of our uh, resources if it does. All right, I'm at level 21. How lucky we can get with this. Okay, here's our mine shaft, so that's fine. It means we're kind of on track. So let's uh, let's actually close this up. We've actually been through here, I think, because I think that's actually a torch. Maybe we have. Maybe I'm not sure. <clears throat> but uh, ooh, got dark real quick. Hey, buddy. There you go. There you go. A little something for you. Yeah, I think I've been through here. So for now, we're just going to close this off so that we're basically safe. All right, we still need to keep moving. So we're still looking about 35 more blocks this direction. I'm hoping, and see, here's the problem. I'm, I'm already running. I hear you, slimies. See, we're at level 12. All right, so from here, we're going to go straight because this is the level we're on. See how how good I can do this. Only, ooh, more gold. That is the one good news with this. At least we're getting the gold we will so desperately need. I'm not going to pass any of this up. All right. Let's fill in these holes. All right, where are we at? Uh... 378, so just a little bit further. Oh. What the do? How the... Wow, my math was... Oh, I know what I did. I know what I did. Oops. Oh, silly math. You guys probably saw that and were laughing at me. 
I overshot it by a bunch, but maybe we can use this to our advantage. All right, that's repaired. So if that's coming out there, what if we what if we made the second cart here? Get over a little bit until I can find that area. I think it's right around here. There we go. All right. Let's get a torch in here. All right, we don't need this anymore. Yeah, I overshot. I still thought I had to go that direction a little bit, but apparently I had gone past it. So, so this works out because this is actually isn't in our way. That's actually something I was worried about because I really want to try and use this here the same as that to kind of set up our mind. So, if, no, you get back, get back there. All right, go ahead and go up. You're going to come right back. So now we can have a cart go this direction. We'll actually fill this in. Cart will come this way. It'll, it'll eat some bread. But yeah, this is a, a much further distance that this is going to have to travel. So I think there's a cave right around here somewhere. Alright. Cool. So this will come up here. And maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll block that off somehow. Maybe I'll put glass on it, I'm not sure. All right, and this will come right up. And then our goal is to get this to travel onto the roof of our blacksmith. So we want it to basically go up like this that and unfortunately well, I guess I can make it turn if I needed to and then say have it turn again all right cool so yeah the cart will come straight up here straight up from down there we'll probably block this oh hey buddy boy I turned around and just looked him dead square in the eye didn't I Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Let's dance. Let's do this. Where you at, sister? Let's make this happen. I'm ready to party. Enderman style. Come on. Come on. I'll throw an egg at you. Get egg in your face. All right, cool. <clears throat> All right, I think that'll work out. I think that'll be kind of cool. I'm going to redo this with stairs to be able to get up here. But And then what I want to do is I'm going to set up basically the same drop-off system that we have there so when we're down in our mine we you know our inventory fills up we go up in the cart on the one side we put you know all of our cobblestone and this and that and stuff we want to send to the surface and then on the cart next to it we put uh you know any of our ores that need to be smelted you know cooked down um iron or you know, iron gold that kind of stuff and then what will happen, and I actually have some gold, so for people who haven't seen it before. So I'm a cart. Chicka, 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 chicka. I come here. I'm going to drop into a hopper. And basically, I'm going to drop the gold in. As you can see, it's falling down, and it's gone. At the point where the inventory on the cart is empty, it will get sent back down. We'll put up some signs and some stuff, too. And then if you look in here, see, that's how our smeltery looks. That's what I wanted is to have that kind of, you know, safety behind the, the metal bars type thing where it's cooking. And as it cooks through, we have gold. Now, the only drawback to work with something like this is that none of the items will actually technically smelt until you get back within, you know, a certain amount of blocks. So if we're you know, way down in the mines and drop it off, it will drop it off, but it won't actually smelt it. So, so all right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I had fun kind of see, you know, a lot of the stuff that I do off camera, which, like I said, it really feels most of the time that I'm doing the majority of everything off camera. And I figure, you know what, I'm going to try and do a little bit more. You know, you get to see me battle some mobs. Very uneventful, but... We're definitely going to go do, maybe on the next episode, we're going to do some uh, 
some exploring more in that cave, see what we can come across, um, and keep looking for gold. And once we, uh, I'll see what I can make in between episodes, or maybe on the next episode I'll just make it. Maybe I'll try not to use much stuff off camera. Maybe that'll be fun for us. So let me know what you think in the comment section. So, anyways, uh, if you liked the video, leave a like. Like I said, leave any comments if you want to see a little bit more of the behind the scenes style stuff on here. Um, Leave that in the comments, and uh, if you don't need to subscribe, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and join the Modi Nation, and uh, we will see you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.